All right, so we just got on the plane, going to Houston, and then uh, got an immediate flight right after Houston to Jacksonville. That'll be fun. day two yesterday we didn't really do a whole lot just um went in jacksonville and then we got chick-fil-a i am gonna go to the apple store and check out my phone because it's actually just not charging anymore it only does wireless charging i can't plug in anything it doesn't work so we're gonna try and see if we can get that figured out if it doesn't it's fine i still have a wireless charger so i'm not too concerned but that's what we're doing right now All right, so finally got the new phone. Um, it took a while yesterday because we went to the Apple store to get it fixed. They didn't, they weren't really able to fix it. I mean, they could, it was gonna be like 700 bucks just to get a brand new phone. So we just might as well say, we might as well just get a new one. So then we went to T-Mobile. It didn't really help there because they were like, it's, we're gonna have to pay off the old phone. My dad didn't want to do that. So we're like, okay, whatever we left. We brought back my phone to the house to go get it charged. It didn't work. Um, we put on the charger and the battery went down and it was extremely hot. So we're like, okay, you gotta get a new phone then. We'll just pay off the phone and we'll just buy a brand new phone. We went to Best Buy and um, they said they can't do T-Mobile activations or anything there. So then we left, to, we left Best Buy, we went back to T-Mobile uh, and T-Mobile doesn't have any of these phones in stock. They don't carry any of the phones for some reason. They only carry the 120 gigabyte I needed a 256, so like whatever. Um, we just waited till today to go to the Apple store and I got my phone now. So that's that's the update now. Um, so yeah, that's day three going on, fun stuff. Board of the ship. It's pretty sick, dude. Already got some drinks, so that's fun. And we got a golf course up here, a little, little mini golf thing. I got some basketball, and if y'all don't know, I'm a basketball player, so we'll see what we're gonna do today. All right, gonna give you a little room tour. Bed, and then we got the balcony. Stand right out here, and you just got the water straight below. Everything. So that's cool. What is that? I got a TV that I'm not even gonna use at all because I don't really watch TV. And then we got bathroom in here. Pretty small. But I'm not worried about it because I'm not really gonna be in here, so. We were also given these like Peruvian chocolate brownie things. Seven out of 10. Not the greatest brownie, but it's good. I'm gonna go up top and go, go enjoy myself in the pools, get some more drinks. Um, because tomorrow we arrive at Coco K, which is like this, this resort sort of thing. It has a really big water park. That'll be fun. I want to record me going on some of the slides, but I'm too, uh, my social anxiety will probably prevent me from doing that. I'm going to try my best. All right. So we're finally moving. Um, we're, we're finally, oh, <laughs> this is so trippy, dude. We're going this way and I'm walking and the waves are going this way. So it like looks like we're moving really fast this way. I'm like, whoa, you know? One of those like illusion things. I'm also I've also had a, had had a, had a few drinks, you know. Let's go out there. My face is white. I am Casper the ghost. Yo, he's doing hard work today. All right, we're going down to dinner. 
I'm out of breath because I ran up the stairs. 4-4 four, four to floor 12. I'm tired, dude. I'm tired. I gotta run back down there because I've already ordered. I ran back up here to get changed and get my phone again. I'll, I'll show you guys a video of everything, you know. Phone eats first, am I right? All right, anyway. Just woke up. We've landed at Coco K. I can't go to sleep because of these dudes right here, dude. Yeah, they're being really loud and obnoxious. Alright, so we tried doing the zip line. It's too windy though, so they told us to come back later if we want to do it. But we'll see. Right now, I'm gonna get suited up to go on this sort of thing there. So that's gonna be fun to do the water park thing. So we'll see. All right, so uh, we got done at the water park. I'm probably gonna go back through there. Um, but we came back to our cabana. It's like right over there. Um, it's pretty dope. I uh, got some food. I got some pizza. I know, pretty, pretty lame for, uh, for an island, but. That's what I got, I got a few drinks, and now I'm kinda in this like cove area. Try it out, this, this really big slide, went at the very top. You go really fast on it, but it, it really hurt my back. I saw some dude uh, with a GoPro going down there, but I was, I didn't bring my GoPro out here because on the real Caribbean like website or whatever, it says you can't bring GoPros on the water slides, but some dude went down with a GoPro. So I don't have any footage of me on the slides. up at the water park um back in the room got the got the fit going on here i walk back in here though what do i name him Alright, so I've just gotten back to the room, took a shower and everything, and uh, I've been kind of looking to see what all I want to do today. At 2.30, I am going to go do this adult dodgeball competition. I'm pretty good at dodgeball, so I mean, at least I think I am, so we're going to go and, and test it out and see how good I actually am at it. Uh, I want to go check out that big purple slide thing. I'm trying to chat with guest services to see if I can bring a GoPro on because I really don't want to go up there and then them being like, oh, you can't bring that on. All right, so I went down the, uh, the ultimate this thing, the, purple, the big purple slide. Um, so the customer service said that I could take the GoPro on. Of course, I did it at the front. was like, you can't have this. So I'm like, okay, whatever. Anyways, the slide itself, it was all right. It was very slow. I mean, maybe just because of how I was going down it, maybe that was the reason. I mean, it was fun. I'm glad I did it, but I'm not going to really do it again unless someone's like hey you want to go do this with me i'm like okay sure but i'm not going to do it on my own again because it just wasn't really that great um so i guess that means i'm not going to take the gopro on the water slides either if i can't take it on this it's like i i had I, I have like the whole chest thing for it so it's like if i can't even have that on then i don't think there's any point of me trying to go down like the water slides or anything with a with the gopro on So just got done with dodgeball. Um, I did pretty good, did all right. Uh, we won the first game against the team that was, I had already won. It was really weird how they did it. They completely forgot about our team. Um, like they were trying to move on with the tournament and they didn't even call our team to go play. We're like, okay, what the hell? I'm like, oh yeah, okay, you'll play against this team who's already won one. And then they called on two other teams. Uh, the team that we had just beat played again. 
um, and beat that team. And then we went on and we lost to the other team that they played. I, I know it's confusing. By the way, like one and one. I got off the most BS reason. The only time I got out was I deflected the ball with the ball. And you can see in the video that I recorded, or my dad recorded actually, that uh, I deflected the ball with the ball. So that means I'm not out. But they called me out or whatever. Um, we ended up losing that game. And then they're like, okay, well, we're gonna move on with the tournament and just have the finals now. And it's like, well, all right. I mean, we beat debatably the best team in the tournament. Um, and then we lost one game and they also lost to us. But you're gonna have us not be able to play again. Uh, these other teams got like three games to play. We only got two, um, but whatever. That's whatever, I'm not gonna, it's just a random dodgeball tournament, so. It's a little frustrating, but at the end of the day, what's it going to matter?